Hello, I am Rupendra Kumar. I am going to perform an experiment of implementation of up-down counter under Programmable Logic Controller Lab. Let us open this experiment and the aim of this experiment is to develop an application using up-down counter. Let us understand what are counters. Here are two types of counters, up counter and down counter. In up counter, when contact changeover takes place, accumulator value increments by 1. When in down counter, changeover takes place, accumulator value decrements by 1. These are block diagrams of count up counter and count down counter. Here are different bits for these counter. In count up counter, these are count up count bit, counter bit, preset bit and accumulator bit. Similarly, in count down counter, here are count down bit, counter bit, preset bit and accumulator bit. These bits have their own functions. We have to develop ladder program according to these diagrams. for countdown counter and count up counter. Let us enter in simulator to develop these programs. First we will develop a program for count up counter. For that we need 4 rungs that I have added already and 4 normally open buttons. and a count up counter two outputs for each bit count up and done bit and a reset output to reset the count up counter now we need to name each element of program I am naming this as on and I am naming the count of counter as cu and providing preset value of 5 accordingly we need to name these inputs As we can see, count of bit is named as cu underscore cu, so I am providing the input name as cu underscore cu. So, this the now for done bit, I am giving name as cu underscore du. As we can see here, cu underscore du is the name for done bit. Now, for reset. I am providing the name reset and the reset output is named as the same name of count up counter CU. Let us name these outputs as lamp 1 and lamp 2. This lamp will start glow according to bits are high now we have completed the ladder program for count up counter let us compile it it is successfully compiled and run as we can see our program is in run mode let us see what happen if i toggle on push button as I have toggled the on push button one time, we can see our count of width is high and lamp 1 is glowing and our counter accumulator value is incremented by 1. Let us perform this experiment until the our preset value is reached by the accumulator value. We can see each time I am toggling the on push button 
accumulator value is incremented by 1. Now we can see as our counter is reached preset value turn bit is high. Now we need to reset the counter as our operation is completed. So to reset the counter just toggle the reset push button. As I have reset the push button our accumulator value is return back to its initial value of 0. By this we have completed the operation of count up counter. Let us reload the page and made a make a fresh program for countdown counter. For countdown counter similarly we need 4 runs. 4 normally open buttons a countdown counter 2 outputs each for countdown bit and done bit and a reset output to reset the countdown counter. Let us name each element of the program. I am naming the first push button as on. Countdown counter is named as CD and I am providing preset value of 5. Accordingly, we have to name these inputs. This is for countdown width. This is for done width. And for reset, I am giving the name reset input. Let us name this output as lamp one. Lamp two. This lamp will start glowing when an respective bit is enabled. Let, let us name the reset same as the count down counter. We have completed the program for count down counter. Let us compile it. It is successfully compiled and run. We can see our program is in run mode and run bit is high. Let us see what happen if I toggle the on push button. As I have toggled the on push button, countdown bit is high and lamp burn is started glowing. Also we can see here our accumulator value is decremented by 1 from preset value. Let us toggle it again. We can see for every transition from off to switch on stage, accumulator value is decrementing by 1. Let us decrement it again. We can see our accumulator value is reached 0. As is it re this is reached 0, our operation is completed. So now we need to reset it. So to reset the button, to reset the counter, just toggle the reset push button. As I have toggled the reset push button, we can see here the accumulator value is reached to its initial value of preset value. By this, we have completed our program of application of countdown counter.
एंड काउंट ऑफ काउंटर्स बूथ थैंक यू